Oh, hello, Dinky Do. It's just me, Scotty McClure. And uh, what we're doing is a quick pop up here uh, to tech, check out some equipment. So if you were watching earlier, we couldn't actually have any sound. Let me know if you can see me and let you know, let me know if you can hear me. All right. So nice and simple there. Really an equipment test for Scotty McClure. We've got show 92 coming up tomorrow evening at nine o'clock live here on Facebook Live. So we need to spread the word about that. But I need to know if this equipment is working and I need to know if you think it's actually an improvement on uh, our normal broadcast equipment or if you think there's ways that it can be improved, do let me know and don't say take Scotty McClure out of vision. I understand that one. That's not a problem. So there we are. Neil Emsley's joined us. Lovely to have you with us. He's with Jennifer Cropper Jaram. That's rather good and uh, lovely to see you all. Uh, hello, says Jennifer Cropper Jaram. Hello, Jennifer Cropper Jaram. Dinky do from Scotty. McClue to you. So let me know about the quality of this broadcast, guys. Is it moving all right? Is it pixelated? Can you hear what I'm saying? Etc. 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 We have sound now, Scotty, says Pauline McConnell. Is it of a good quality, Pauline? That's what we're asking here. Let me know about the quality of the sound. Let me know about the quality of the picture. Is it a reasonable representation of Scotty McClue? Or do you prefer what we normally do on Facebook? live broadcasts with me scotty mcclue hello scotty this is brian mcneely hello brian lovely to have you with us dinky do and uh, as i say this is just a pop-up to check out equipment if you're feeling flush and you'd like to contribute to the equipment fund please do so you go to scotty mcclue's website www.scotty-mcclue.com and you'll see logos for paypal and for GoFundMe. One of the greatest causes in the world. I had an idiot on the other day, one or two of them on actually on Facebook, but I had an idiot on saying, what about all the charities that are needing money and everything? Well, he doesn't seem to realize that if you sponsor one of the world's top broadcasters or the world's top broadcaster, you're going to end up taking care of so many charities anyway. But uh, some people just do not see the big picture. It um, It's slightly amusing, actually, to watch the little minds working, isn't it? People who don't see the big picture. Uh, Susan Copeland Power, Dinky Doo, hi. Uh, Scotty, she says, and three lovely cases. Hello, Susan, my dearest, dearest lady. Thank you so much for all your kindness and generosity. Um, we did attempt to email to say thank you, but we got a bounce back on the email. So I, I don't know what was going on there, but I'm so glad that you're here. And I could say thank you for your very, very kind and generous donation to uh, the Scotty McClue show. Grow the show, I say. So thank you, Susan. Now, uh, your coupons are as red as a beetroot boss, says Murray Ramage. Well, there we are. Yes, it is. I think that's uh, partly the camera. Uh, I'm not blaming my tools, of course, partly the camera and partly my coupon, which is as red as a beetroot. So there we are. Uh, and we don't normally have that on uh, a Sunday night. Is that the case? So let's know. If you're just joining us, of course, do let us know what you think of the equipment we're broadcasting with. We didn't have sound before. There might be another pop-up after this. I just got rid of the last one, by the way. So if you're looking for it with a good number of shares and a good number of viewers, but I just popped that one because um, it wasn't serving any great useful purpose because it didn't have any sound on it. And I do think we should have sound on our broadcast. So there we are. Evening, Scotty. Sounding loud and clear, my friend. That's excellent. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. No bother, says Susan Copeland Power, but it was so lovely of you, Susan. And if everybody followed suit and gave a donation to the Scotty McClue Fund, either GoFundMe or PayPal, they're both on the Scotty McClue website. They're 100% secure so you could click click pop your card in a couple of pounds five pounds ten pounds fifteen pounds whatever you think old mcclue is worth after 40 years of broadcasting thirty-six thousand hours so there you are 26 years of the scotty mcclue show thirty-six thousand hours of unscripted broadcasting how amazing is that there is not one media mogul who would not have Scotty McClure in a heartbeat, but they don't know how to go about it. It's as simple as that. All they need to do is give me a wee phone call and say, Scotty, I want to put you right across my network because you're a global figure and you're somebody that the world 
trusts. And of course, it always makes me laugh when people say, how can he be a global figure sitting there in a flat cap, chattering away on social media? Well, the answer is, it's there for all to see. A real top broadcaster had 962 views on a national show recently. McClue had 14,000. What about that? 932 views against 14,000 for Scotty McClue, and I'm not even on his network. How amazing is that? So that just lets you know the real power of social media. We're also looking at uh, streaming live on YouTube as well, simultaneously with the Sunday night shows on Facebook Live. And of course, it depends if the Facebook algorithm keeps the figures down so you don't actually get to see it. Then uh, they're usually smaller. Other times they're up, as I say, um, week before last, 14,000 of you very kindly had a wee swatch at McClue's Facebook video. What about that? How amazing is that? So there we are. Now then, uh, hello, Scotty. How are you doing, Mr. Thomas Hamilton? Yes, you're still handsome, Scotty, even with your beetroot mush. My friend, lol. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Sharon Holmes, thank you so much. It's so kind of you to say. And uh, Elaine Sylvester McNeil says, Hello, hello, Elaine Sylvester McNeil. Do I look like a, a rabbit caught in the headlights when I look over to read your massages? So there you are. We've got them there. Excellent stuff. And um, it just depends on the camera angles. We need to get that right. Uh, John Amably is with us. How lovely. Gus McPhee, Dinky Do. You're all watching Scotty McClure on a Saturday night. And we're live on the big one, Facebook Live. The big show, of course, comes up for one hour between 9 o'clock and 10 o'clock British Summer Time, live on Facebook Live on a Sunday evening. As I say, if you're popping out tonight, you're feeling flush, you want to stick a couple of pounds in, five pounds, ten pounds, somebody put a hundred pounds in, how lovely is that, into Scotty McClure's PayPal. So there we are. The GoFundMe. Uh, we've put £5,000 on the goal, and it's sitting at, uh, I think it's about 500 so 10%. There we are. That's excellent. I mean, it's very, very good of you. And it, what it allows me to do, guys, is look at little bits of equipment that I think I haven't the money for that at the moment. And uh, But it will make a massive difference. Uh, also get yourselves on to the YouTube, uh, Scotty McClue, YouTube, uh, YouTube.com forward slash user, forward slash Scotty McClue one. So there we are. Get yourselves onto that. Very, very important. There's a new Scotty McClue Facebook. If anybody's wanting advertising, public speaking, anything that you think I would love Scotty McClue to do that, you can get that on a new Facebook page. So there you are. That's excellent. How come you're on on a Saturday? Says Thomas Hamilton. We're just testing equipment really ostensibly, Thomas, but it's lovely to have everybody with us. There are PML, says Elaine Sylvester McNeil. Absolutely, PML to you, my dear. <laughs> I'd rather have PML than PMT, I'll tell you that. So there we are, marvellous. Right, uh, and what else is happening? What's your news for goodness sake? Tell me your news, and I will tell the world. I will broadcast it live to the nation, not just one nation, but globally. People are watching in Australia, New Zealand, and Canada, and America, and Tasmania, and the Arctic, the Antarctic, Russia, China, Japan. So there we are. Wonderful stuff every day watching Scotty McClure and saying dinky do. So do come on if I've missed your comment. I do apologize. Uh, we're on new equipment tonight. So let me know if you think it's better or if we're better on our normal standard equipment. I'm adding stuff to it, but that's not to say that I've got everything within spec. All right, so there we are. Uh, David Johnson joined us. Hello, David, lovely to have you with us. And dig you do. Guys, if you can do the usual standard stuff, though, and share, 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 Scotty McClure. If you see Scotty McClure, anything with Scotty McClure on it, just share it, all right? There's a huge setup out there. And, of course, uh, there's a massive, massive push for independence in Scotland at the moment. Um, I do like that. You know, there's, there's various politicians going, Scotland's second of it. They've had enough. They don't want any more. I mean, we've only had one referendum. There was a guy that used to be quite a big name in politics, and he was saying, the Scots are second of referendums. Well, we've only had one. So there we are. Um, I'm from Glasgow, but love. 
says Elaine Sylvester McNeil. Quite right, quite right, excellent. Uh, where is the PayPal, says Elaine Sylvester McNeil. You go on to Scotty McClure's website, Elaine, www.scotty-mcclure.com and you'll see PayPal and uh, GoFundMe. They're 100% safe. You can use your card on it, and you could put in a fiver or a tenner or a couple of quid. If every single one of you, for instance, if the 14,000 that watched us last week had stuck in a quid, think how far down the road we'd be with equipment. Marvellous stuff. So think about that. That'd be excellent. There's William Renfrew has joined us. How good is that, Willie? What do you think of the new equipment? Is it working? Are you all getting me loud and clear? Is my uh, coupon clear? Stuff like that. All right. So there you are. If you do want to make a small contribution, that would be fabulous. And uh, as I say, don't think all oh, the money could be better on this, that, and the next thing. It's actually better with me, Scotty McClue, simply because I can do amazing things with tiny amounts of money, right? And you're watching one of them right now. Now, so there we are. We've got uh, we've got some new equipment, but as I say, I may not have it all within spec at the moment. But as long as you can see me and hear me, I might even pop back up tonight with another piece of equipment, and we'll try that as well. If you've just joined us and you're wondering what on earth's going on, it's Scotty McClue. We are, of course, live on the Big One Facebook Live. We're hoping to stream live on YouTube as well. But do get yourself onto the Scotty McClue YouTube channel, and you will see some of our um, test transmissions. Do you like that one? Test transmissions. So there we are. Coming through loud and proud in Derby, says Tony here. We love Derby, Tony. The home of Rolls Royce and the railways. A wonderful part of the world. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful countryside. I visited the um, tremendous Chatsworth house when uh, the Duchess and the Duke were still living. Andrew and Debo and uh, they were still living at the time and it was lovely to see them at the wonderful Chatsworth House. What a stunning place. And I was most impressed because it had been open to the public, I think, since the 1890s. So there we are. We do like that. Tremendous. And of course, Andrew became the Duke. His, um, his brother uh, was killed just, I think, near the end of the Second World War. He was married to Kathleen Kennedy, John F. Kennedy's sister. And uh, she was sadly killed in a plane crash in 1948 but a lovely lady so there were kick kick kennedy uh, marvelous stuff better kick patterns joined us dinky do to you better lovely to have you with us what a marvelous marvelous lady and uh, where else are we coming through if you're watching in australia or new zealand or canada or america do let us know. I think it's very, very important. Say, Scott and Blue, dinky do to you. Dave Harley, and Ingalls, my goodness me, all these wonderful, talented people just popping on to say hi to old McClue. And I think that's excellent. It's very, very much appreciated. As I say, every media, media mogul in the world uh, wishes they had Scotty McClue, but they just don't know how to go about it. They need to swallow their pride and pick up the phone and say, is that Scotty McClue? I'd like you across my whole network, making millions and millions of pounds for me, like you've done for so many others. So there we are. That's what we'll do for them. I always remember a chief executive coming up after a company got sold on, and he said, do you know, Scotty, you should have had a share of this. I said, no, please don't give it a thought. <laughs> That's all you can say, isn't it? So there you are. And a hi, says Katie Martin. Hi, Katie. Lovely to have you with us. And a couple of lovely kisses to you, my darling. So good to have the company of so many wonderful and so many beautiful people. So make sure that you share this long and far. So as you see a Scotty McClue thing, I know sometimes for some of you, it's a bit of a pain. You think, oh, for goodness sake, this Scotty McClue sending me stuff through again. But it's just that although my name happens to be on the show, it's your show. It's perhaps the biggest talk show in the world. As I say, um, a huge national channel with a very, very well-known broadcaster last week, 900. 123 views on Facebook Live and Scotty McClue had 14,000. It just shows you, doesn't it? They don't believe it until they see the figures. And even then they think, is that a mirage or am I seeing things? Amazing. Uh, am I invisible? 
So there you are. No, you're not visible, Lorraine Murphy. Of course. How could you be invisible, my dear? Nobody's invisible to Scotty McClure. You look quite warm, Scotty, says Louis Faber. I am, Louis, actually. A little bit warm. Excuse me. And I'll do a little bit of, um, what do you call it, a comfort break. In other words, I'll give my pus a malt doon. Oh, it's very warm. Oh, I don't know about where you are. Is that better? I don't know where you are, but uh, in Scotland, it's very, very warm at the moment. We've been expecting thunder. But we haven't actually had any. So there you are. Who else have we got? So Lorraine Murphy, am I invisible? I do love that. Amazing. <coughs> Pardon me. Uh, so uh, that's you up to date with what's happening. What I think I'll do, I'll push off now. I may pop up again with another piece of equipment. So uh, put on a tracksuit, says Louis Faber. Yes. Well, I'm not getting changed in front of the world, Louis. Um, but I might just do that. I always like to be a little bit formal on a Saturday evening, you know, in case somebody rings and says, would you like to come out with us? <laughs> it very often happens. And depending on who it is, you have to think, um, I'm washing my hair. I'm watching television. So there we go. I did pick up uh, a video the other day, uh, nice and cheap, of, uh, of Ryan's daughter, the David Lean film, Ryan's daughter, which I haven't seen for years, Robert Mitchum. And I might watch that. Another great favourite, of course, Where Eagles Dare, uh, The Wild Geese, uh, The Fourth Protocol. These are all amazing movies, guys, if you want to get into them. Rosalind Colday says, hi, Scotty. Hi, Rosalind. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Doo. So if you want a quick hi, we're really testing equipment tonight. We're not doing what you'd call a serious show. And um, that's, as you know, Scott McClure is a very serious broadcaster, big, big on the political scene. We've got all that happening. Scotty, you're some man. I'm from Stevenson, says Joe Ryan. Joe Ryan, it's a lovely part of the world to come from, Stevenson. So there you are. Very, very nice indeed. And of course, you're very handy for the sea, handy for the ocean. We were just talking this week. And the weather has been so good in Scotland. that We're actually thinking, do you know, if we had this weather for a few months, you would see Scotland repopulate. And a lot of holidays abroad in Spain and Portugal and Greek and Greece and all that sort of thing would be being cancelled because people say, no, no, we're thinking, so, you know, we visit to Rothsey. Who knows, the Clyde steamers might come back, right? I'm not talking about some of the people you see coming out of the pubs. I'm talking about actual ships. Uh, that used to uh, ply the waters of the River Clyde. How amazing is that? Sarah Peebles, oh, lovely, the hearts and the eyes. We love it, we love it. Um, you know, they should bring out one with your heart on your sleeve. You know, people say, oh, I don't think she wears her heart on her sleeve. Very, very interesting, that kind of, I, I like language so much, just big communication. And uh, that's why I communicate with, with millions. In fact, we're getting on to billions of people. Do you know about two and a half million people have watched the Sunday night shows? In total, two and a half million. I mean, that is absolutely incredible. McClure's been about for 26 years in about a couple of weeks' time. Absolutely incredible. And I saw the wonderful Mike Kenfield the manager of Red Rose Radio at the time, the general manager, the man who took on Scotty McClue. So there we are. What a great claim to fame. Lovely man. 16 years married today. Congratulations to Mike and Denise. How amazing is that? Um, so there are Sarah Babels. I do. I do. Excellent. I do. What? What are you saying I do to? Watch what you say I do to. For goodness sake. Um, are we moving around or are we pixelating or is it slow? Do let me know how it's going. Come on, Louis Faber, you're very, very good with uh, with technical equipment. You're very good with checking that things are done properly. So there we are. Is it coming across correctly? Uh, correctly? Can you hear me? Can you see me? Um, any criticisms of this particular bit of equipment? Can I use it to broadcast on Sunday nights? Or do we go back to our standard equipment? All right. Uh, a pint of lager, Scotty. Thank you very much, Sarah. I'm not actually drinking. So there we are. Not drinking at the moment. Lasted a drink of alcohol about um, two and a half years ago. So there we are, because I decided that I wanted to drive the car at all times of the day and night. And I couldn't be bothered counting up units and things like that. But I did thoroughly enjoy a light refreshment, I must be honest. Right hand up to the big man. Paul Nalon, I don't like this. Well, what is it you're doing, Paul, that you don't like? You have to tell us what you're doing. You can't just say, I don't like this, when we don't know what it is that you don't actually like. All right, so fess up. Step up to the plate, I say. 
Uh, wear your heart in your sleeves. <laughs> How marvellous is that? What don't you like? Is it the equipment? Is it the fact that uh, I'm looking different? Uh, you know, do let us know. This one is better, pal, says Thomas Hamilton. Interesting, Thomas. Yes. So it's actually clear, but I'm just wondering, would it be as good when everybody piles in and joins us? I mean, if you like, I'll try this tomorrow night and see how we go. Um, but uh, but we have to decide what's best. So there we go. Uh, once we get it right, as I say, two and a half million people at least have had a look at the Sunday night shows and the Facebook Live videos, you know, bit of fun there. But it's good stuff. And that's also with Facebook not letting everybody see it. Do you know what I mean? They don't want everybody to see it. Uh, you know, unless I coughed up, which um, I uh, don't do enough coughing up because we don't have have the pennies for that. But if you would like to pop a couple of pounds, five pounds, ten pounds into PayPal or into the GoFundMe page, it's a hundred percent secure. You can use your card. Go on Scotty McClue's website, scotty mcclue.com S C O T T I E hyphen M C C L U E dot com. In fact, what I'll do is guys, I'll put it up here for goodness sake. I'm in the communications business. Here we are right here. And I could put this up for you. Why don't I just do that? And then that'll let you know. So there we go. And we've got um, how good is that? There we go. Uh, excellent stuff, right, PayPal? And it's at www. Dot, sorry about the hand blocking out the camera. We need to sort all that out for you, but we will do. And we get the pennies to buy the equipment. Chicken and egg, which came first? Scotty McClue or the equipment? Right, uh, what about that? It's coming in there, guys. Can you see all that? PayPal at www.scotty-mcclue.com. So that should come up in front of you and let you know what's what. We might also do a show. I wonder if we can do a share here. Can we share this? Yes, I'm quite sure we can. Anyway, if you can share my clue, get sharing, share and 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 share. Lovely stuff. But as I say, it would be very much appreciated if everybody could spare a couple of pounds. As I say, if the 14,000 that watched us last week could put uh, a couple of pounds in, we would have been able to buy the equipment now and get this show on the road. Grow the show. Hashtag grow the show. Now, if you're a Twitter person, do us a massive favour. Go on and follow Scotty McClue at Scotty McClue, the little A, and then capital S, small C, O, double T, I, E, capital M, small C, capital C, L, U, E, at Scotty McClue on Twitter. But uh, it's not for the faith hearted you will get a lot of tweets back and forward but just set your notifications if you don't want them if you want them just enjoy have fun right too many morning minis around there you are paypal at scottymcclue.com have you got it there guys and we'll just put a like up somebody said to me today did you just love your own post i said yes of course what's the problem why would you put something if you don't actually like it <laughs> it's very strange. So they go, oh, that's a bit, uh, what's the term they use? That's a bit um, narcissistic and stuff like that. You know, I mean, oh, dearie, dearie, dearie me. As if the rest of us hadn't got anything more to worry us than whether or not Scotty McClue liked one of his own posts. I don't understand where the world's coming from and all that stuff. So there you go. Right. Um, is it time I pushed off? Uh, use this one for Sunday, says Thomas Hamilton. Hello, says Dee Gourley. Hello, Dee. Lovely to have you with us. And dinky do, I say. There we are. There's a wee love heart. We'll pop that on. That's what it's all needing. And uh, there we are. PayPal, scottymcclue.com. So get yourselves on there and the Scotty McClue website will come up. Are my eyes darting about a bit? Am I a bit rabbit caught in the headlamps with this one? We'll try the next one. If you're about for the next few minutes, we might try the next one. Like you see, although it's seven o'clock on Saturday night, you'll all be getting ready to go out, for goodness sake. If you're on uh, Periscope, then get on to Scotty McClue, Twitter and Periscope. Also, if you're on LinkedIn, if you're a business person, you want to join me on LinkedIn, then you'll get Scotty McClue on LinkedIn. In. If you're a media mogul, always remember the lovely story of the media mogul when a programmer said, a program director, 
uh, popped into the office of the media mogul and said, <coughs> there's no way to, there's no straight way to just ask you this apart from the straight way. Could we afford to have Scotty McClure on board? And the media mogul fixed him and he said, can we afford not to have Scotty McClure on board? So there you are. There's radio setups that have gone into history that would have done very, very well had they hired Scotty McClure. Amazing, isn't it? Right, so that's that. Nothing like a bit of modesty. I am the world's most modest man. I say as well as being the world's top broadcaster and the first lord of the internet. So there we are. Sarah's having a good laugh there. Three lovely big smiley faces. Send us lots of hearts and thumbs up, guys. Come on, before I go, let's have some tap, 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 de tap, tap, de tap, de tap, de tap. And, uh, and we will see what is what. That would be amazing. Right, I'm going to end this now. You'll be glad to hear all good things come to an end. But uh, if I don't see you within the next few minutes, then I'll see you tomorrow night at 9 o'clock sharp, live here on Facebook Live. Be there or be square. Remember, if you miss a minute of Scotty McClure, you miss a minute of life. Dinky-doo.